We begin by testing for light touch. Use a twisted piece of cotton wool. Ask the patient to shut their eyes, then either to tell you the location where they are being touched or just to say a simple yes. Aim to test most of the dermatomes, particularly in the upper and lower limbs. Testing should be done in an unpredictable manner rather than in a linear progression. Touch lightly and avoid pressure or dragging the cotton wool across adjacent dermatomes. This motion will also stimulate the hair follicles. My arm. Left leg. Right leg. Right leg. Left leg. Left leg. Right toe. Right leg. Right leg. Now test for pain using a clean pin, preferably a neuropin. Never use a hypodermic needle or a previously used pin. Demonstrate to the patient what you're going to do and what is expected of them. First, with their eyes open, choose a sensitive part on their body to demonstrate to them what a sharp and a dull sensation should feel like. Now tell the patient to shut their eyes and begin testing. Paying particular attention to clinically important dermatomes or suspect areas. Test in an unpredictable fashion using mostly the sharp end of the pin and less the blunt end. Dull. Sharp. 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 Dull. Sharp. 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 Okay, now I'm going to do the same on your legs. Sharp. Dull. Sharp. 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 Dull. Dull. Sharp. 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 If you discover an area where pain sensation is reduced, try to map out the area by testing from the center of this area outwards towards the intact area. Also ascertain whether the affected area conforms to a dermatomal or peripheral nerve distribution. Don't forget to take into consideration variation in skin thickness as this will affect the degree of sensitivity.